Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Donna and look it says hi. Or is that an abbreviation for Hawaii? Should I be saying aloha? Aloha everyone. Anyway, welcome to my channel and today I'm participating in the hashtag new to me. Hashtag new to me is an open collaboration hosted by Kimmy's Kitchen and more. Everyone's welcome to participate. All you have to do is share something that's new to you. Go ahead and add that hashtag and tag Kimmy in the description. So, can you guess what's new to me? I mean, here's the hint right here. What are these? These are little thingamajiggies that go with a die cutting machine. Yes, so you guessed it. I got a die cutting machine. And I am surprised at how heavy and sturdy this thing is. Anyway, I got the Spellbinders Platinum 6 manual die cutting machine. And it is completely new to me. I have never done die cutting at all. Never one time. Never even sampled it anywhere. Completely new to me. This machine comes really compact. It opens up. Whoops, sorry, I'm shaking everything here. We're not on the sturdiest of tables. And it came with everything I needed to get started. It came with the machine itself, the little sample die cuts. It came with a platform. And it says on the platform how to lay everything out to do your little die cuts and embossing. So... It's pretty simple even for someone like me who's not very crafty. It seems easy to use. I've already tried my high a couple times. You can see it has scraped into the plate already. So from what I gather I put the platform down. I add a cutting plate and then I add the well see here's where it's a little confusing I think I have seen people in videos put the paper down and then put the die cut with the sharp side down on the paper the way this is saying to do it is to add the die cut itself with the sharp side up make sure I got that right and then you put your paper and then you add your other cutting plate on top to make the sandwich. I guess I could put that in the middle more. Let's see, and then we're gonna kind of turn it through. It might be a little tricky because I'm on a table that has a little tablecloth on it, so yeah, it went fine. Whoops, it slid. slid off the paper because I didn't have it in there correctly so I got a funny look in each. <laughs> Let's see. See? Funny look in each. Now I have seen people that they use a little washi tape and tape it down. To, that's probably why to make sure things don't go slipping and sliding. Let's try one more time. Put the H down. Put that paper right there. You know, I'm going to be playing with this for a while. It has the embossing plates too. It has like a little rubbery plate and then the embossing plate. So it's going to be fun. I know I'm going to have fun with it, but now I need to get some die cut um, thingamajiggies there. Where's the best place to get them? Is it Hobby Lobby, Joann's, Michael's? Oh, that looked like that went real easy. Wow. I may just get the hang of it. So, whoops, there's the H. Took it off. Got that. And then we got that H. So I did it. I think it's going to be a lot of fun. It's new to me. I'll be crafting, crafting. 
there is a lady with an adorable little chihuahua that has walked up and down so many times. I think the chihuahua loves my yard. Must know that I love chihuahuas. <laughs> Alrighty, you guys, I hope you all having a great day, and I will check in later. Bye.